الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم أما بعد حبيت في الله as we know طهارة is a شرط من شروط الصلاة طهارة is a شرط من شروط الصلاة meaning that the conditions for prayer one of the conditions for prayer is, is tahara, that we are purified for the salat. In a hadith of Rasulullah sallallahu hadith of Abi Huraira radiallahu ta'ala an, qal, qal, qal Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, ya la yaqbalu salata ahadikum ida ahdatha hatta yatawadda'u. The Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, one of you, your prayer is not accepted if you have hadith, if you break your wudu until you make wudu. From this hadith of Rasulullah it is evident that one must have wudu for prayer because we only know that from the shara, we know that from nasus. We don't know that just from our intellect. We know that we have to have Purification and tahara from the divine book of Allah and the son of the Messenger of Allah, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. This hadith shows us that Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala does not accept your prayer without tahara, and this is the asal, meaning that unless it was a situation where you're totally unable to make tahara, for example, someone who's in prison, someone who's being tortured. And they are praying, they pray in their, in their condition, in whichever condition they are. If they are unable, they're chained, locked up, they're unable to purify themselves. So they pray in their state. We ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil.